Elections are a central feature of democracy. For elections to express the will of the electorate, they must be free and fair. Free means that all those entitled to vote have the right to be registered and to vote, and must be free to make their choice. Fair means that all registered political parties have an equal right to contest the election's campaign for voters' support and hold meetings and rallies. This gives them a fair chance to convince voters to vote for them. There are over 6 million registered voters for this year's elections in Zimbabwe, compared to the 2018 elections, which had 5.3 million. The C leader, Mr. Nelson Chamisa, says more than 60 of the party's meetings were banned or disrupted by the police during this period of election campaign. For the past decades, Zimbabwean polls have been marred with political violence and contested results with the opposition claiming that votes had been rigged. Other contenders include Douglas Nwanzora, the new MDC leader, and Elizabeth Valerio, the only female candidate. Kelvin Berimauro, reporting for Movie TV News. We as a sovereign state and a member of the United Nations, we have a sovereign right to run our elections uninterfered. Those countries who want to observe must restrict themselves to the role of observing our elections, not to interfere in that process who will not accept it.